Hello, here's a new one for a feature that I added to JMesh Tools. It is an explicit Boolean mode. Here I have a simple mesh in Blender 3 and a cutter that I want to reuse to cut into the mesh. So press Ctrl, Shift and B to open the Boolean mode. And I use the Move tool to move the cutter to a location where I want to cut into the mesh. For example here. And now I Ctrl, Left click onto the mesh to execute a difference Boolean. The operation is set to difference, this is why we cut into the mesh, and the cutter object is not deleted. If you want it to be deleted, then you control and shift click onto the mesh. So this is very easy to control in this mode. Let me show this here with the operation type set to slice. I open the boolean mode, you can also press this button, and then I press the O key to set the operation to slice. Ok, now I control click onto the mesh, the cutter is still there and the slice is executed. Now I rotate this object by pressing the R key, then move it again over the mesh and now I control shift click onto the mesh to execute the slice and delete the object. Looks nice, now I can give it a different material and then symmetrize all objects. You see these are separate objects, so I can scale and move this one separately. The boolean mode is also great if you want to reuse a cutter for different objects. This one is made of two objects, first I want to cut into the silver part. So go to boolean mode and control click onto this part. The boolean is executed, the cutter not removed, so I can reuse it to cut into the other object. Therefore I move it upwards and rotate it, like that, then I move it to the location where I want to cut. Ok, and then control click onto the black object. Then I cut another hole, somewhere like here. And you see this is perfectly reusable and after that I symmetrize again. I know it's a small feature but sometimes it's really comfortable to boolean like that. The add-on is still free, link is in the description but you can also get it from the Blender market and if you get it from there I can give you special support and you also support the Blender dev fund. you find the link in the description below. Oh and before I forget it, I also added the shortcut, the keyboard shortcut to the preferences for the boolean mode and you can change the colors, the font size and the location of the OSD. So guys, I hope you like the add-on and my channel. If you do, then please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also follow me on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter and support me by becoming a channel member, this would be great. If you have questions, add these to the comments and I'll see you in the next one here on JNM.